Good afternoon, everyone. Brand new release day, and believe it or not, Jaspies is doing, we are doing personal boxes of Heritage Baseball, the brand new Heritage Baseball. Uh, thanks to Otani and all the other uh, variations and all sorts of short prints and all sorts of fun stuff in there. That's why this is, this is going to be one of the hot products this week. So Mr. Dave Barrows with a personal box, and he requested me to open this up live. Now, if you purchase a personal box, we will default to shipping this to you sealed. But if you want this, uh, if you would like this to be opened up live, I can do that for you as well. Just be sure to let us know, uh, actually via email or chat, I guess, if you're watching live. All right. Good luck, Dave. Let's open up all of these first. Obviously, everything ships in the uh, in a personal box. So, Dave, when you uh, and anybody who who gets a personal box, when you get these, be sure to check. I think Beckett has a good checklist. Cardboard Connection as well. I'm sure, Group Rate checklist as well. We'll have uh, we'll have a a guide on all of the variations and all the short prints and whatnot. So be sure to check the backs of the cards and be sure to look at the pictures carefully for all the different for all the different short prints and variations because some of that stuff could uh, could go for a lot on a secondary market. A lot of people still build sets from Heritage. So whatever short print you have may be the one that someone is looking for. So it, a lot of these cards will still carry a lot of value. And it's a, it's a relic or autograph per box. Obviously, the big autograph we're looking for would be Otani. Even even his variation of base cards are selling for a lot. Prices are crazy for him, so we're going to keep an eye out for that. We have a uh, we have half case divisionals of this available as well. And um, vet base will not ship in that, but uh, all the variations and short prints will. I wouldn't be surprised if we end up shipping everything in the. Don't quote me on this, but I wouldn't be surprised if we end up shipping everything in a uh, in that divisional break. It might just be easier than trying to spot all the different parallels and whatever. We could leave that to you. This this is a lot of fun. This this is something that you could. You can introduce the kids to, you know, and and um, there's a there's a lot of uh, what do I what did I call it last year? Treasure hunting. That's what it is. There's, there's a lot of treasure hunting here. You get you have a guide. You you hunt for the treasure. You hunt for all the different short prints and everything. So should be a lot of fun. Okay. Good luck, Dave. Thank you for grabbing uh grabbing this box. The Tops News sort of look. And the late, uh, I think, 1969 design. I think a lot of the variations, this is a facsimile autograph, right there, Clint Frazier. So people will build sets of those as well. I think the variations, or at least one of the variations that I know that we can spot pretty easily is um, is uh, in-game action shots. So a lot of these, as you can tell, are just like these portrait shots, right? But uh, the in-game action sort of photos are one of the more easier variations to, uh, to spot. There's a chrome card in here too. A couple of Aaron Judges here. Chrome card is Miguel Cabrera, 331 out of 569, honoring the 1969 design. All 
I wonder, there's always, every year there's always like a big rookie that blows up. I wonder who will be that rookie this year, you know? I mean, not not everyone, not everyone was sold on Aaron Judge. And he ended up crushing. <laughs> Michael House's Mason House. Is he gonna, is he gonna play this year? I thought he was still a little bit younger. There's my boy Corey Seager, game used memorabilia for Corey Seager, clubhouse collection relic. So unfortunately, it's one or the other. I mean, unless they added a bonus for you, Dave. But let's see if we can spot a, uh, let's see if we can spot an Otani. Because even those base cards, we haven't seen that base card yet. Cody Ballinger. Another one of these photo portraits. See O'Turtle in the house. See him in the chat. All right, last bit, Dave. Good luck. I feel like every time I see an Angels logo, I'm going to be like, is it him? That's definitely not Otani. Oh, come on. Well, that's that. No Otani. But a couple nice cards, nice uh, Corey Seager relic. Let's see what's in that box topper. I don't know if those, bo are those box toppers? Could they be autographs? Maybe, probably actually. I'm sure they're hard to hit, but I'm sure they, they exist. And right here we have Rizzo belts two homers in victory. And there's Greg Holland, who is still a free agent looking for big money. Uh, Will Myers for the Padres, and then your 2018 rookie stars, Verdugo and Walker Bueller. Those are a couple nice ones for my Dodgers. All right, there you go, Dave Barrows. Thank you very much for grabbing that personal box on jazbeeshobbyland.com. We also have half-case divisionals available too, so check it out. Thanks very much, everyone. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.